The Wabash Valley's most watched newscast continues with Storm Team 10's Lindsay Monroe. Good morning, everyone. Rain showers, main weather story for us today. Roadway is going to be wet for you out there because the rain continuing to fall during the entire day today. We're also talking the cooler temperatures only sitting at 48 degrees and with that breeze at five miles per hour. While it's not too strong, it's a cool breeze and it's going to make it feel even cooler out there. Here's what we have in the bigger picture. It shows you that center of low pressure off to our north. All this rain wrapping around it, rotating in a counterclockwise motion. Here at home, we're going to see the rain with us at this point. You saw up to our northwest. More rain working its way in during the day today. We're going to keep the cloudy skies, the chance for rain showers with us through this afternoon and even into this evening. So make sure you have that rain gear handy as you head out the door this morning. Temperatures starting off at 45 degrees up in Rockville. It's 50 in Linton, 48 here in Terre Haute, 46 up in Paris. It's 51 in Robinson. Temperatures were in the mid to upper 50s a little bit earlier this morning. They've fallen since then and we're not going to warm up. We're going to stay in the lower 50s and the upper 40s during the entire day today. Pretty steady temperatures and they're going to stay pretty cool as well. We'll fall off as we head through this afternoon into this evening back into the lower 40s. Keeping that chance of rain with us. It's just going to be one of those gloomy days out there. Not much going to change as we head through the day. Good news is we will dry things out for your Saturday and a very pleasant weekend setting up. So let's look at what we have out there for today. Scattered rain showers lasting with us through midday today. This is your lunchtime forecast. Still going to be on the rainy side. Off and on showers lasting with us through this evening as well. Those temperatures right around 50 degrees at this point. We're going to stay in the mid to upper 40s. Temperatures falling off as we head through this evening. The wind still staying on the breezy side out of the southwest to stay near 15, gusting up near 20 miles per hour. So not only will the rain continue, it will continue to be breezy out there, making it feel even cooler as well. And your forecast, the rain showers lasting from start to finish today, starting off in the mid 40s. Driving up to the upper 40s, being right around 50 degrees by the 5 o'clock hour. On feature cast at 8 o'clock tonight, if you do have outdoor plans, make sure to keep that umbrella handy and the warm weather closed because it's going to be cool out there. Rain continuing to fall during the evening tonight, lasting through the overnight hours, and even a chance for a few spotty showers as we wake up on Saturday morning. Temperatures in the lower 40s. Not going to warm up too much for your Saturday afternoon. High is only in the upper 50s. The good news is the rain will work its way off to our east by for our Friday, or Saturday morning. rather. A few lingering clouds with us at this point, but we're going to get in on some clearing skies. High pressure taking control of our weather for the second half of the weekend. Sunshine for the second half of the day on Saturday. Then as we head through the first part of the day on Sunday, the sky will completely clear out for us. It'll be a cool overnight with temperatures dropping back near 40 degrees, but highs on Sunday are turning near 69. So some warmer air starting to work its way back in, and we're going to kick off a warming trend as we head through next week as well. 50 today. Up to 58 by tomorrow, 69 for Sunday. Then you see we're going to stay in the 70s. There's your average into the upper 60s for this time of year. Some very comfortable weather going to be with us as we head through next week. Today, though, it's going to be a cool and gloomy one. It's kind of rain showers lasting with us through the entire day today. Highs right around 50 degrees. We'll drop back near 41 during the overnight tonight, keeping about a 40% shot of some scattered rain showers lasting with us. Tomorrow, finally, we see that rain working its way out of the Wabash Valley. We'll start off with partly cloudy skies, maybe a chance for some lingering showers Saturday morning. Other than that, we'll get into mostly sunny skies later in the day. It's still cool with highs near 58, but then that big warm up kicks up on Sunday with highs near 69. Back into the 70s by next week. And by next week, we're going to be looking at these graphics all in HD. And that's true. By next week, I can't. This is the thing. I'm trying to wrap my head around the fact that it's actually happening. That's the thing. Um, people, when I was hired six years ago, I was told, don't get too comfortable. We'll be in a new building. That's what people have been told that for a long mm -hmm. time. It's actually happening. Monday, we're in a new building. This is our last day from 918 Ohio Street. We're broadcasting the morning show. Do you remember the first time you came into the building? I do. It looks pretty similar. It was for a midday newscast. You were anchoring. Uh -huh. Pamela Gardner was doing weather. And of course, I went to college with Pam. So mm -hmm. I was like, oh, re reminiscing. I remember <laughs> you. And it was a really good experience. It's kind of 
when you walked into the building, you knew you were home. And you, yeah. you told me that you had a similar feeling when I, you first came. I did. I did. This was actually my second interview. My first was out in West Virginia. And I, I just didn't get a good vibe out there. But as soon as I walked in this building and walked up those back stairs, um, our former executive producer, Mandy Hopton, was the one brought me upstairs. She's like, hey, I'm a Ball State grad, too. And mm -hmm. I felt instantly connected. And you just get this vibe in this building like your home, it's here, I call it our little building that could, <laughs> and we're slowly pulling into the station, and so all day long we're going to be showing you different people's uh, memories and things from the building, and we're having a good time, we're excited, but it's kind of bittersweet too, so we'll be, we'll be in high def Monday morning, can't wait to show you that. Thanks, Lindsay.